Hello and welcome to the course on regulatory and supervisory technology or RegTech and SupTech. I am sure that if you are into this industry or if you are new to this industry, you might have heard of three buzzwords, FinTech, RegTech and SupTech. FinTech is something that we have already discussed in our different courses and we, are, we have made a lot of other courses on FinTech, digital payments, open banking and all other courses. We will continue to develop more such courses. However, in this course, we'll talk about RegTech and SupTech and we will demystify what is these buzzwords and what is the meaning of regulatory technology and supervisory technology why it has suddenly become so important what are different features of it different companies which is working in which are working in regtech and subtech industry so regtech and subtech has garnered a lot of importance in recent times the reason being a lot of regulatory uh, fines compliance breach and hence the cost of compliance is increasing why because now there because of so many so many scams which is happening there are so many uh, regulatory failures which is happening that there are many big companies Companies who were like considered once too big to fail kind of companies are also failing and a lot of things have been attributed to their regulatory reporting and also from the regulators side labs as well and hence RegTech and SupTech promises that using technologies like AI, machine learning, IoT, blockchain, distributed ledger technologies, RPAs and all other newest technology which we'll discuss in this course how using these technologies these two factors RegTech which is from the institution side and soup tech which is from the regulator or the supervisor side can solve that problem so i welcome you to this course and i am so much excited to explain about these two buzzwords which you will listen whenever you go to the financial services sector however there is a myth that reg tech and soup tech is only for financial services but let me tell you reg tech and soup tech can be applied in all other regulated uh, industries which means that this can be used by any regulator it can be of financial services non financial nature so anywhere wherever the industry is regulated by any supervisor or any regulated entity or any regulator of the country this reg tech and soup tech can be used so i just want to break that myth that soup tech and reg tech is only for financial services so let us see in the course what's more in reg tech and soup tech so see you in the course take care and see you there thank you